Hi, I'm Tammy Rosenthal, your host of American Dream TV. Today, we're at Ballparks National in Max Creek, Missouri, and we're gonna meet with our general manager, Jeff Vernetti, and he's gonna show us around and tell us what's going on. I wanna introduce you to Jeff Vernetti. He is the general manager of Ballparks National, and just, we're excited to hear what's going on here. You've got some expansion. Um, I know not many people know what exactly you do and how many people you bring into the area, so give us the scoop. Yeah, it's exciting. We're uh, getting ready to uh, expand and add three fields. Uh, we've got five fields currently as we enter our third year, and we're really happy about the design. You know, uh, we, you know, we built and bought the land back in 2015, so it took several years for it to get built and open. We really focused on the design, so as you see, you know, we angled in all the sight lines, we kept the foul territory short. You know, the fields are built for kids to hit home runs, so right now the five fields we have are built for boys up to about 12, okay. but then girls of all ages, this is a perfect size field for high school and college. So we'll have all age uh, girls play here in, in State Fair Community College just played this season. So we'll, uh, we'll have uh, a ton of college players come. So on an average weekend, how, how many people come into the ballparks? Yeah, with five fields, uh, right now we're at the, usually between 40 and 45 teams a weekend is a sellout. So that's why we're building more fields. Oh, wow. We just have a tremendous uh, demand because once you get above that, then the game times have to be short, then people are playing late into Sundays and they need to get home. So, um, you know, we'll have close to 3,000 people on a sellout weekend between, you know, all the players and moms and dads and coaches and grandmas that want to come. And for those that don't, uh, can't make it here, we stream all the games live so they, oh, you know, cool. parents at home can can dial in and see see the action. Um, but yeah, it's, it's a few thousand people every single weekend. So it is a constant grind out here. All right, so we're waiting between games. What's there to do? Yeah, there's a lot to do here. Uh, and we're really happy and we designed this to have a lot of open space. So you'll see people in this main plaza or off to the side, setting up their own tents and bringing their own games in. Of course, we've got bouncy houses for the little ones that uh, uh, parents like to watch the kids having fun. We've got a radar speed pitch machine where kids can test their arm and see how fast they can throw. And then of course our great concessions and our, our deck and bar will have bags and uh, washers and other tailgating like games for people to do. So what about the parents? What do we do while we're our kids are off playing? Well, lots. we're really proud of our food and beverage service here. Uh, so there's a lot of good things to eat. But of course, our deck and bar is, is really kind of the showpiece of the whole uh, park. It's right smack dab in the middle of the complex. It's 2,500 square feet, lots of tables and things to do. So wh whether you want to have a cocktail or just a nice uh, you know, dinner or lunch, we've got it all for you here. So here we are in the concession area. It's shaded got these air conditioner fans blowing on us yep. and you have a huge menu yes yeah, so we have a lot of healthy food choices and we're really excited that we're adding more and more each year this year we're going to actually do sort of a to-go salad so salad in a bowl for those that want that but we do turkey wraps we have some vegetarian options it's not just junk food because uh, we actually, we don't have anything that sits in a warmer. We okay. don't have anything that just is wrapped. It's not, it's, it's cooked to order. It's not like a fast food restaurant. So we'll have uh, some of our most popular things are your regular nachos, but with pulled pork on top, it's mucho nachos. Uh, our pretzels are about the size of a home plate. They're enormous, the, the pretzilla. You'll have to check that out. It's, it's definitely shareable. You've really opened my eyes. This is a great facility. Thank I'm you. really excited about it. Awesome. Well, thanks for coming. Thank you so very much. Appreciate it. All righty. Well, that was a lot of fun, and I'm a little sad that it's over, but they told me there's no crying in baseball. I'm Tammy Rosenthal, and we'll see you next time on American Dream TV, Selling the Ozarks.